Okay. Is this your work? Huh? Oh, yeah. I scraped that together with what I remembered from my aunt's research. It charts the roots of the caravans that vanished in the Emerald Abyss. This is really good, Dax. You don't have to sound so surprised. Aunt Cordea taught me a thing or two before she disappeared. Gotta say, you seem a much better cartographer than Sentinel. Hey, I'd be a great Sentinel if the Commander would let me stretch my wings. Mm-hmm. Shut up. I'm going to hit everyone up first. Oh, wrong button. I always do that. Well, the bar has a lot of chat options. Let's head there. Probably that Lord douche. Hey, Max. How's business? Business is great. Loads more people are stopping by. Of course, they're claiming the Dominion's coming and we're all gonna die, so it might not stay good. That's not going to happen. Oh, I never bet against the house. So will it be this time, freelancer? My friend Faye brought a tape player in here. How hard would it be to get more Dawnguard episodes? Dawnguard, huh? They make that one in Antium. Radio broadcast doesn't reach that far. For it to play here, someone's got to bring tapes by Strider. Slow. Expensive. Oh, uh, so the answer is hard. Okay. <laughs> Grab its feet. I'll owe you a favor. You can collect it whenever you want. You got a deal. You might regret not putting any limits on that one, though. All sorts of things I could use a spare freelancer for. Some of them are even legal. Well, now I'm a little worried. Relax. I won't ask you to pants, Commander Vu. Probably. Make that extremely worried. Come back later. I'll get your tapes. It'll be fine. More or less. Like Max. Aruna. Freelancer. Doing well? Lots of talk about you around town. Uh, nice things, I hope. Mostly complimentary. Though I do wonder if the tales have grown in the telling. Apparently, you're the best at, I believe the phrase is, Ursix punchining. Ursix punchining is one of my many skills. Right below javelin sky zooms and pew pew projectiles? You're making fun. No! What have you been up to? Taking a few days off. Checking messages from Antium. I've got another expedition lined up after that. What is it you actually do? Matthias said you knew things about reality. Sort of. I study the effects of conflicts between the Anthem of Creation and Shaper Constructs. Meaning? My theory is that the Anthem is like a river, carving the landscape as it rushes on. Shaper Constructs are dams built to harness that awesome power for... Well, we don't know. And where the river meets the dam, chaos, turbulence. You study that turbulence. Exactly. That's a really interesting way to put it. Never thought of it that way. Oh, I've come up with various analogies to explain things to people who aren't arcanists. You probably have a better understanding of our world than most, being a freelancer. I protect people from the turbulence. I don't always understand it. We're two sides of the same coin, aren't we? I observe. I learn why things happen. And you. You stop people from being washed away when the dam breaks. And they all break eventually. Tell me about it. All right. I'm going to get more tea. Talk to you soon. Who goes to a bar for tea?
Hello. You're a freelancer, aren't you? Do we know each other? Word gets around. There was a time my job was to listen to those words. Huh. So that makes you... A spy. Nadira's husband. I think she spoke to you. Right, she did. You must be late. <laughs> this isn't awkward. A grown man prodded into making friends. But my wife insisted. She said you were a spy? You must have been one of Tassin's people. Not quite. I was fighting her people. Dominion. Ah. Ex-Dominion. I see Nadira fail to mention that. Yeah. Don't worry. I defected. I respect that. The Dominion are a pretty terrible bunch to work for. Yeah, that's easy to say when you're outside of it. But inside, a man's conscience is never allowed to take root. Like this monitor you've been dealing with. I know his kind well. I can't imagine. It's a chorus of one. People forced to sing the same notes. Control, tyranny, supremacy. They become the only notes you know. Sounds like hell. I ran from it. Any life in Bastion had to be better than Strahlheim. Most people here are just trying to make their way, live simply, find some happiness. Yes, decent people. It's all I ever wanted to be. Decency is a commodity in short supply in this world. If we can't find it, we must grow it ourselves. So you're a spy and a philosopher. It was my wife who said that the day I defected to Corvus. She debriefed me. I fell for Nadira before the day was even out. Must have been one hell of a day. She was a light at the end of a very dark tunnel. Here was a woman who'd fought in the same shadows I had, yet never surrendered her conscience. Glad to hear it worked out. Made the risk of leaving the Dominion worth it. Meeting Nadira saved me. I sometimes wonder if I hadn't left, hadn't crossed her path. My life before, I... I it was... I, I did things. Are you okay? I'm... I'm fine. I'm sorry. Bad memories from before. I try not to think about it. Nadira mentioned that. She thinks talking about the past will help me. We'll see how it goes. Well, until next time. Yes, I'm, I'm still learning to make friends the normal way. I hope you'll drop by again. Ex-Dominion. I have definitely murdered many people that he might have known. Amal. Oh. This guy's voiced by that one dude. Hello, my name's Amal, and I'm your bartender, freelancer. Nice to meet you. Did you recognize my voice when I said freelancer? Was I supposed to? Well, I was in season one of Dawn Guard, so I thought you might. Really? What was your character's name? Sentinel Two. Sentinel One got to open the gate, but I was always at his shoulder. Just in the first season? Yeah, in the second to the last episode of season one, I got killed by a scorpion. That's too bad. Yeah, but that's life, right? You gotta be tough if you want to be an actor. Who knows? Maybe you'll get another shot. You're probably right. I don't think Dongard appreciated me. Hey, you're pretty smart. I could use your advice. Okay. So there's this lady that comes to the bar, and I think she's attracted to me. What makes you think that? She said, and I quote, I'm super attracted to you. So what's the problem? First, she's married. Second, to an aggressive Lancer. And third, I am terrible at saying no. How do you think I should handle this? Just pretend you're playing a character who's great at saying no. That's a great idea. I'll act my way out of this. I think my character will be firm, but friendly. Just like Sentinel 2, you know? My role in Dawn Guard. Sounds like you got this. You are a wise person. I'm not going to forget this. If I ever get into a jam, I know who I'll come to for help. Great. No, oh, great. I bet you that that woman's voice sounds like uh, at least his interpretation of her was like a 40 year old smoker. So, uh, I can't imagine what this woman looks like. Hey, Alec. You know, people always tell me, Alec, your good looks and charm 
You could be a governor or something. Uh, which people? You know, people. And I say, no thanks. A governor doesn't get their hands dirty figuring out how the world works. Freelancers do. Don't ever forget that. It's one of the things I like about this job. Like my old javelin I'm fixing up. The seal, the gateway, they're all part of a finely crafted machine. Tune it properly, and you can fly. Forget to oil a gear, and it's just a hunk of metal. What about the world? Just a fancy machine. Faye think there's more to it. The anthem and all that energy of creation. I think the shapers like to tinker. That's what the relics are for. Gears to make the world run. Hopefully the Shaper's plans were to make things run better. I think it works both ways. How so? Well, the mechanic in me sees a world tuned for both life and death. Both can be a bitch. Though, the Shaper's nailed the waterfalls. I figured you'd hate the Shaper's. Hard of rage and all. I got enough problems. I don't want to hate the whole damn world, too. Figured being a freelancer is a way to prove otherwise. You should have been an arcanist. Huh. Right. Because the answer to the world is in some book? I don't think so. <laughs> a lot more fun tricking around the jungle in a metal suit, scaring the crap out of grabbits. <laughs> okay, we got Merelda, Eason Giles, and then we'll go punch some dudes. Hello again, Marelda. Still people watching? There you are. I was starting to think you had missed dinner. I didn't know we had plans. All that time in Freemark? You haven't had a home-cooked meal in years. The Kyler I knew never turned down grilled gazic. Kyler? The name I gave you the day I brought you into this world. No wonder I never heard from you. The anthem must have set a few screws loose. You seem a little tired. Maybe think about getting some rest? Rest? You finally come back, and that's how you apologize. Mom, go take a nap. Well, it's just that... It wasn't easy, Kyla. Everyone told me you were dead, but deep down, I knew if you loved someone enough, the anthem of creation would make it right. Somehow it would bring my son back to me. If it hadn't, I couldn't live without my boy. I'm sorry you went through all that, Mom, but I'm here now. It's good to be back. It's okay. Now, don't be mad. But there's no grilled gazic. I went vegetarian years ago. See what you miss when you're gone? Sorry. Seems like yesterday you were playing with your javelin toys, dreaming of being a freelancer. Now look at you. Strong, handsome, all grown up and following your dream. There's no better job in the world. Thank your father. I always thought it was too dangerous, but he said you could do anything. Where is Dad? I guess you wouldn't know. When you didn't come back, it broke his heart. He died in his sleep. I still have his ashes. I thought we might spread them together. Uh, of course. I'm sure that's how Dad would want it. His ashes were all I had. The only reminder I wasn't alone in this world. You're never alone. Plenty of people in Fort Tarsus. None that loved me. But you're back now. I want to hear all about your adventures. But this excitement has worn me out. We'll talk later. When you're not too busy? Of course. See you later. Oh, poor senile old lady. What do you think would make that kind of... Hey! I learned something about a certain someone that I believe may be of interest to you. I doubt it. Yeah, right. Brace yourself, because this is gonna hit you pretty hard. Sentinel Dax is actually a princess. Everyone in the fort knows that. Really? Yes, it's common knowledge. Oh, well, it's still pretty interesting, though, right? <laughs> it was the first 50 times I heard it. Okay, I hear you. But you're still gonna come to me for all your inside information, right? I never did. So, nothing's changed with this? No. Whew. Good, okay. So, 
Hey, do you want to go for a bite or something? Mm, nope no. or no. I get it. Next time, I swear I'm going to be a better friend. I will always be your friend. <laughs> this poor guy. I mean, he's super annoying, but like in a you feel bad for him kind of way. Like, oh, I don't have any friends. I don't know how to act around people. Anyway, let's get this journal. Exactly. I've marked a potential ambush site. Oh man, I missed the like intro speech. Patrol's nearby. I'll explain in person. 
in person. Really? Just bring it to me. like squiggles to me. Oh boy. We found the Strider, but it's been ambushed by a Titan. Today is not a good day for Striders. Hey, the Titan took care of the hard part. Now, you just gotta find a way inside without it killing you. That's always the rush. Oh my god, this thing has got some meat. <laughs> Wyverns too? Where are my comrades in arms? So much health. What? That's bullshit. Oh wait, we can respawn? 
Respawning has never... Oh, because we've always been in a non-respawn zone. This thing's got some freaking health. Hit it with some ultimates, people. Well, I'm gonna die. <laughs> this guy hits like a truck. I get you, bud. Uh, why can't I heal you? Tried resin that guy, the prompts wouldn't pop up though. We found another scroll. Listen the images together. Well, what do you know? Dax was right. If it happens again, she'll catch up with a broken clock. Hey, I can hear you. Mocking talent space. <laughs> Literally right there. I understand that they need this to make sure everyone stays grouped together slash gets credit, but 
man. Give me a little bit more time than five seconds, you know? Dax, you okay? This thing was built to take a few hits, right? Ooh, legendary. <laughs> He's not getting up. Boom! You see that? He's so badass. Watch your six. You mean... I like her. <laughs> Is it over? Already? Stay back! I'm, I'm warning you! Don't tell me that's talent. <laughs> no, just a worm. He won't be a problem. Well, how do you... Come on, let's finish this. We're Give me one job. Make sure you don't get it. Did Talon give you permission to burn it? No. Maybe. Shut up! Okay, why does Talon even want that journal? Because it's a treasure map. All those missing people carried valuables into the jungle. And when I find them, I'll be rich. You shouldn't have chased me, Dex. You shouldn't have robbed me, Talon. It's what I do. You knew that when you hired me. You hired these people? That's how they got your journal? It's hard to do background checks out here. Besides, Talon used to be a sentinel. And now he's been reduced to this. Huh. And you die first. Talon! The journal! Toss it here! Hey! Look out! Oh, that, that's probably bad. Are you alive? Yeah, is that your hand? No, it's mine. Move it. Now. Okay. Which way did Talon go? Commander, how'd you find us? I followed the smoke. Passed by what was left of your javelin. I can explain. No, you're done. There's someone waiting at Fort Tarsus to take you home. Commander, wait. This journal belonged to my aunt. It can solve the mystery of the Emerald Abyss. Hey! Give it back! Consider yourself lucky that you still have a javelin, freelancer. At least Talon doesn't have the journal. He doesn't need it anymore. Just didn't want you to have it. He's so far ahead. You should just give up. Give up? Yeah. Not what I do. Good. Dax! We'll figure it out. Just meet me back at the port. <laughs> she is, uh... She is not meant for royalty. She's like, uh, you know, Princess Bean from, uh... Disenchantment.
let's see if uh, she has a say anything to her real quick before I, you know, cut the video. Do 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 do. Dax has been escorted to her apartment. Should I patch her through? Go ahead, Faye. Dax, you really need to work on your whispering skills. What? I'm like a rabbit in the night. Uh-huh. Does Vool still have the journal? As far as I know. Tried to get it back, but he says I can't be trusted with that book of nonsense. You might have more luck, though. It's worth a shot. Okay. Whoa. Her, her eyes were... <laughs> Uh Oh, Morelda. Okay, well, we'll talk to all these people before the next uh, vid.